Hey everybody, it's Average Joey and Charlie here. We thought we'd give you a, a quick little tour of our van. So I could uh, make this video on some beautiful, you know, serene lakeside or campsite in the beautiful plains, but the reality of living in a van and being a touring musician is that I spend a lot of time between the Planet Fitness parking lot and the Walmart parking lot. This is my van, her name is Lily. She's a 2011 Ford Transit Connect. Let's have a look. Cool. So this is the kitchen. You got your magnetic spices. This table flips up so you can chop your veggies. And then the camp stove goes under there. Pots and pans. And I invented this little paper towel holster. Treats to keep Charlie happy. Here's the bathroom. Keep my little bag with all my toothbrush and whatnot. Extra storage down here. A little mirror to see what's going on. Keep the hammock always ready to go. So this thing here was actually in the van when I bought it. I bought it from a guy who did like lawn care service. Um, but it's a little cabinet that I've kind of built to build around. You open that up and it's got, uh, you know, all my food, peanut butter, protein shakes, NA beers. Uh, and then down here is my vitamins and my tea and a little cutting board. And in this side of the cabinet is where I keep all my clothes. Got a little hat rack. And uh, there is a sense of organization to this that only I know. So this is the bed build. It's very simple. Um, we just raised up the cabinet a little bit and then put up some wood here, built it back and then threw down some plywood on top. I actually recycled the wood that I had in my previous build in my pickup truck and uh, used it to build the bed in the van. I'm also not the building type, so I got a lot of help from my friend Andy and my friend Sam to build uh, this whole setup, so thanks to them. Underneath here, we have storage that fits right under the bed. Keep my water jug, my cooler, and the dog food. And then we pull those things out. We've got storage underneath the cabinet for access merch and uh, weights and just kind of random stuff. And then the instruments go here. Coming over to the side of the van, we've got the uh, the mud room, so you can kind of hang up your hang up your hat, wipe your feet down before you come on in to cuddle with Charlie. I've also got my office space set up here, so uh, keep all my books in this little shelf. This flips up, so you have a little writing desk where you can put your your movies and your TV shows on there when you want to lounge back and watch your watch your programs. Again, always keeping things in crevices. Got my raincoat, my laundry goes in this little extra space there. I've got these uh, little holsters on the back of each seat. Keep my, my, my jewels and stuff in there, headlamp, Charlie's dog toys, all of Charlie's medicines and harnesses and things go under the driver's seat. Look at this perfect angel. On this side of the van, um, just more storage underneath the bed. I keep my merch and instrument stands and other things of that nature. So I got my little reading lamp here in the back so when I'm wanting to read something at night before bedtime. And then you put up these curtains so no one can see your butt while you're getting changed in the Walmart parking lot. I set up this um, net here to add a little extra bonus storage. Um, above the cabinet is where I keep all my shoes. Uh, I have a, an alarming amount of shoes for someone who is kind of homeless. And over here I tore away the lining of the van to expose some extra bonus cubbies. Behind the passenger seat I keep all my tools and, uh, you know, things that the vehicle might need. Underneath the passenger seat I keep a rope just in case a game of Rumpy Stumpy needs to be had. Driving snacks go in this little crate here so they're always on hand. And then there's also, you know, all the things that you need to make it feel like home. This is my little altar, my little plant. It's not doing so good, but it lives in a van, so do I. I've got my little photo wall here of memories and folks who aren't with us anymore and friends and keep me company. Here I have a, you know, my sticker bombed cabinet <clears throat> of all the different bands or places I traveled to and whatnot. 
Someone just gave me this sticker. Here's a little touch. I keep this photograph here of when I was working at a whiskey distillery in Pittsburgh and just hating it as a reminder that even when things are bad on the road, they're not as bad as this guy. I also get to have cool art on display. Here's a stained glass feather made by Brit. Here's a piece given to me by AC. And lucky rabbit's foot. Ain't that the truth. So that's our little van tour. Thanks for checking it out. Average Joey and Charlie signing off.